Hi, my name is Travis. I help build Runway. In the next couple of minutes, you'll learn some basics so you can be up and running in no time. Let's go. After you sign into Runway, you'll see a page like this one. It is divided into the following areas. A place to create new action items. Some tabs that allow you to manage your actions. We will explain these later. For now, you'll stay on the Actions tab where all your new actions will be placed. A focus area that allows you to filter large lists of actions. And finally, a list of actions. When you first log into your Runway account, we preload a few actions to get you started. Let's create our first action. Click into the new action field at the top of the screen and type, call dad to wish him a happy birthday. Then press enter or click the add button. That's all there is to it. Whoa, don't forget the milk. The cursor should still be active in the field at the top of the screen. So we can quickly start typing in another action. Let's type the following, buy milk and press enter. You should now have two actions in the actions list at the top of the page. So far, so good. You can click an action to select it. You can also use the up and down arrow keys on your keyboard to move the selection up and down. This is a convenient way to scroll through long lists of actions. It can also be used to control which action is affected when you use our shortcut keys. We'll cover shortcut keys in another screencast, but you can always check out our guides if you want to skip ahead. When you create actions in Runway, they are placed at the top of the list by default. You can drag and drop actions to rearrange them relative to each other. When you hover over an action, you can see that it has a grip. You can use this to rank your actions. This is a simple and effective way to make sure the most important actions are at the top of your list. Notice how the other actions jump out of the way to make room for it? When you hover over an action in the list, a set of controls appear to let you manage that particular action. We'll talk about these a little later on. You can click edit to change an action, or if you're a keyboard user, you can hit E on your keyboard to open that action for editing. You can cancel editing either by clicking on cancel or by pressing the escape key on your keyboard. When you edit an action, the action name is replaced by a field so you can overtype any part of the action's details. Note that you can edit not only the action description but also the context, time and energy settings for the action. Runway also supports a special shorthand for typing in actions quickly and you can also use this format when creating actions too. We'll cover custom context in the next screencast. Let's imagine we need to buy some eggs as well as some milk. We also think that this will require no energy at all. Let's edit our action to reflect this change. Adjust your action so it reads buy milk and eggs at errands, 20 min, none. Press enter to save the changes. It's very simple to mark an action as complete in Runway. Simply hover over the action and click the tick icon on the right hand side of the action. We've added our first action to Runway and now want to mark it as done. Let's hover over this action and click the tick icon now. When you mark an action as done, it disappears from the Actions tab, Action List. For keyboard users, hitting the D key on your keyboard will mark the action as done. Imagine that you realise you don't need the milk and eggs after all. You can delete an action by hovering over it and clicking the trash can icon. When you delete an action, it disappears from the to-do list. Keyboard users can hit the X key on your keyboard and delete the selected action. If you delete an action by mistake or mark it as done by mistake, you can fix this by clicking on the leftmost icon in the group of icons to the right of the action name. Don't worry if you can't remember which icon to use. If you hover over each icon, a description of its purpose will appear. You now know how to create, edit, complete, delete and rank your actions using Runway. There's more to learn, but you have enough knowledge now to start getting things done. We really hope you enjoy using Runway and please let us know what you think.